I was born in Tehran, Iran, in a semi-religious family. My dad was a descendant of one of the prophets of Islam, and he was well respected because of that. By 1979, when the Iranian uh, revolution took place, uh, Islamic regime took over the uh, Iranian community, and uh, studying Quran became one of the most important subjects at elementary and high schools. I was practicing Islam when I was in Iran. And uh, because uh, just by attending school, you have to do the prayers, you have to do, read the Quran on a daily basis at school. But when the war between Iran and Iraq started, my, my, my father decided to get me out of the country. And uh, my journey out of Iran uh, took seven days. And I'm still amazed how I survived uh, through that journey. And by 1985, finally, I was able to come to the United States on the Thanksgiving Eve. I remember the spring of 93, on my way to school, I found a Bible in the middle of the road. And when I opened it, the first thing that took my attention was John 8, 12, where Jesus says, I am the light of the world. And about two months after that, Bible went on my bookshelf until the, the spring of uh, 96, which I found my second Bible. The only verse which was circled, which took most of my attention was John 6.35, which Jesus said, I am the bread of life. And uh, again, after a couple of months of reading this uh, uh, precious book, it went on my bookshelf until 2002 uh, winter, which I went to, to an ATM machine and I found the third Bible on the trash can. And I started attending Cathedral of Faith off and on until the, the Sunday Easter production of 2008, which I had a strong uh, conviction to surrender my life to Jesus. Uh, I remember during the, uh, the Easter production uh, service, when the Jesus came out of the tomb, I, 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 I felt his presence. And uh, at, at that moment, I felt uh, all my sins were forgiven. I trust in God in every circumstances in my life and in all I do. And I, uh, in personal life and in professional life as a chiropractor. And also, I share the word of God with my patients which uh, I believe is a, one of the greatest way to influence and change their health and their lives at the same time. I'm, I'm thankful God for bringing me to Cathedral of Faith on that Sunday uh, Easter service, which changed my life forever.